I'm not used to seeing my hair curled anymore. I rarely even get to curl it. But today I want to curl it, kind of get back to myself a little bit. So today is Tuesday and I have a lot to do. I have a caregiver for three hours, but I also have physical therapy for mom at 12. So I have to sneak in grocery shopping, Costco, the bank, the library, and grocery shopping. Yeah. Running around like a mad woman trying to get all my errands done. I just got done getting some of my um, gloves from my mom from Harbor Freight. Went to the grocery store already. Did physical therapy with mom. She walked. It was awesome. She did a lot today. So she's tuckered out with a caregiver right now. Now I'm headed over to Walmart to get some wipes for my mom. And then Costco because we, we are running low on TP and toilet paper. And... Before I get home, I need to run to the library, drop off a book, and then I need to go to CVS and pick up my own medication. Oh, my God. It's crazy. It is uh, 546. I went home and I crashed out. I took a nap. And I even heard myself snoring. You ever, like, slept so good that you heard yourself snore? I guess I was just out. Kitty was sleeping somewhat beside me. She didn't care if I snored. So um, I have now my husband with my mom real quick. It's um, 15 minutes to 6. So I'm going to return this awesome, awesome um, library book. Don't sweat the small stuff. This was a great read. I really enjoyed it. I learned a lot from it. And um, I can already tell. Oh, wait. <laughs> let there be light I could already tell a difference just in my attitude and the way I'm thinking so um anyways yeah so I gotta go ahead and return this this should be interesting it's all dark she do today <laughs> so I just want to make sure that I do my due diligence and return this on time so different coming here at nighttime huh It's making chili dogs, and um, husband likes chili dogs, and I so I got him this. So we'll see. Oh, let's face it, we all like chili dogs, but we gotta think of the hubby too, make him happy. Listen to those birds. That's not like an audio sound plug-in. That's like real. That's real life. Ah, uh, the nature. They're all just telling us good morning. <laughs> good to see you out here, Denise. Look, she's back. <laughs> Look, it's Dee Lovey Life. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> came in from my run and of course she sees me wearing black pants and of course kitty just has to feel like she has to come over and try to lie on my lap because you know that's what they do they see black and they're like i must get fur all over her look she's wearing black aren't you kitty is that what you're saying Well, good morning to you, too. Say good morning to YouTube. Hey. Kitty. Kitty. Sister. Mm. I defrosted my um, mushroom soup that I had made. I'll link the video down below about my recipe. Oh my God, it's so tasty, just like the first time. Maybe even better. And I'm watching, um, as I'm sitting here having my soup, I am watching Boho Chick, and uh, she's eating her pumpkin soup. And go check out her video. Um, she also 
made pumpkin soup from scratch and I cannot wait to try that. Um, so this is like a perfect night. It's a little nippy out and um, this is just a perfect night for soup. Soup is way good. You gotta try it. I can't wait to try your pumpkin soup. Oh my God. Good morning. It is um, Thursday morning. I keep the curtains closed just to keep the cold out. These these windows just are not double paned yet. So just started my coffee. Ready to start my day. Whatever it has for me, it'll be a good day. Well, that's a pretty shot. I could go out there and pick up the fruit from the lemon tree. You know, one of these days I'm gonna have to make homemade lemonade. I know, I haven't even done it. Maybe that's something I will video record. thinking about the holidays you know I've been trying to catch up with my YouTube all day yesterday somewhat um, in between kind of cleaning here and there but you know God the holidays are coming the holidays are coming ah! remember the Christmas story that's how you feel ah! <laughs> starting to see videos about holiday baking um, decorating everybody's houses are like already busted out in the holiday um, season everything looks perfect and everyone seems all nice and calm and cool with their budgets <laughs> I am in no way near a holiday anything and Thanksgiving is like in a couple of days and I feel like I don't even have a menu planned I don't have I just don't have my stuff together people that's just the way it is and I'm okay with it I guess but sometimes I feel like like with commercials and everything else, you're supposed to have this, you know, nice warm fire with a beautiful professional decorated tree. I'm getting on Facebook and my friends are like hiring professionals to string up their lights outside. And I'm thinking, people do that? They actually like hire people to get lights up? I don't know. I guess I'm old school. We just do it ourselves. I mean, I can understand if someone's disabled or the elderly or someone who just can't. I understand that. But I guess to each its own. It's like the whole concept of having a housekeeper. I would love to have a housekeeper. <laughs> a maid service. Um, and if you do, that's awesome. I'm jealous. Um, so anyways, I'm getting back on track of what I was going to say. Is that it's getting pretty overwhelming right now. And, um... You know, I feel like everybody else has it together except for me. <laughs> and I have, I don't really have that many people coming over for Thanksgiving. It's just really my my father and my stepmother. And they're going to be here with their dog, my little stepsister. And it's just going to be the five of us for Thanksgiving dinner. So we're kind of keeping it very low key, but I'm still making everything from scratch. And I'm just going to try to make it as less complicated as possible especially as being a full-time caregiver um it's hard you know so i'm trying to balance everything else or everyone out um the husband the family the friends um kind of dropping the ball on the friends lately though i admit that i gotta really get back on track and um and for next the following weekend we're planning on having a crab feed we're going to have about 20 or so people here at our house so I am looking online for like crab feed decorations and all that. but 
I feel like I should be doing stuff for Christmas. Like, when do you guys start putting out Christmas stuff around your house? And do people still call this Christmas? I mean, I like to call it Christmas. I know, like, people were saying it shouldn't be Christmas. It should be the holiday. Well, I guess I still call it Christmas. Um, so, you know, what... What day do you guys think it's okay to start putting up holiday decorations in your house? A lot of people will do it like Thanksgiving or the day after. Um, I'm not too sure exactly when I'm going to actually put it up. My neighbors around us um, were all kind of casually late. <laughs> Some of us will put decorations up like a week before, you know, Christmas Day. It's so hilarious. Uh, but um, I'm hoping I can get things up a little bit early this year just so that we can enjoy it for the whole month of December. I have friends who've already done their Christmas shopping and all their presents are already wrapped. Their house is already decorated and like they're sharing it on Facebook and I'm like, really? <laughs> That's how I feel. So I'm just curious about you guys too out there. When do you guys start putting up your Christmas decorations? What else is going on? Um, besides all the holiday rush and all that, um, I'm trying to keep it things in perspective. I'm trying to remind myself that, you know, it's okay if you don't have all your stuff all ready. I mean, really my main priority is caring for my mom and my husband and as long as the three of us are happy that's all that matters um and so far i'm really excited my husband took off all next week so he will be home with us so that'll be really nice and um, my father is coming up from las vegas so um that's going to be really nice to spend some time with him as well and really i mean I just have to put things in perspective and it's okay not to have everything all ready and all, you know, perfect and everything else because God knows my house ain't perfect. <laughs> if you see my declutter videos, you totally know. And yes, I haven't forgotten. I still need to do another declutter video. I have a lot of decluttering still to do. I just, I'm getting not, I want to say burned out. I'm just getting exhausted. I'm really been um, doing a lot around the house and I haven't really been recording because I guess when I'm on a roll I just really don't want to take the time out to record and stop and record and stop but um, I definitely owe you guys another decluttering video and especially with the Thanksgiving and the holidays I really need to do something within the kitchen so I'm hoping I can set up my camera and my tripod um, this afternoon and try to get that all done. And I also need to clean out my refrigerator um, this weekend. It's going to rain tomorrow and it is a gorgeous, nice sunny day out there. So I really want to take advantage of being outside. I have to still go out for my walk and finish my walk 100 miles challenge. So go check out that video. And uh, really, I think that's basically what I'm going to be doing this week. So I'm hoping I can record as much as I can. I just want to check in with you guys and just kind of tell you what's going on. That's pretty much it. I'm trying to drink more water. Um, and I don't know why that's hard. <laughs> I don't know. And I have to do my nails. My nails are getting really bad. Yeah, I I think at this point, I've been really taking an hour in the morning to myself. I get up really early just so that I can sit down, I can read, or I can work on my planner, or I can just really just veg. I mean, literally, there are times where I just sit on my recliner and I just gaze outside just to take a moment, you know? And if I don't take time out for myself, I notice that it really does affect my day. So I'm really trying really hard to start my day with an hour to myself, which is working out great. But I really need to start taking the time out like to do my nails, to do my hair, and all that other good stuff. So I um, hope you guys are all doing well too. Hope you guys are taking good care of yourself. Remember about yourself. This is me going up in our attic. 
let me just check out and see where our holiday decorations are. Oh lordy. So I have all of those way back over there. Yeah, sound like a good plan, but it ain't gonna happen. <laughs> uh, this is our our upstairs attic. Yeah, can you say water? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, I just yeah. Nah. We'll do Christmas decorations or holiday decorations maybe in a, in a week, couple of weeks. Not today. <laughs>